Well, I'm sure y'all have probably heard the saying that owners and their pets can sometimes look alike. I just don't see it in this particular case. Right, Callie? But what I would like to see is my KX450 looking a little bit more like me. It used to have the green and black plastics. I pulled them off for another project. But what I did was I ordered a set of white and black plastics, sort of to match my hair. So I'm excited to see if that looks any better. I did a little goofy rendering on Photoshop and I think I like the way it looks. So stick around if you want to see what it looks like. Excuse me if it sounds a little bit windy. We're dealing with some of the effects from Hurricane Ian that just went through Florida and my thoughts are with them and I hope everybody's okay down there. I know there's a lot of damage and uh, power outage and a little bit of loss of life so it's a terrible thing. So I ended up picking this kit up and the kit's made by UFO. Uh, they're the only ones I believe that make the white and black plastic for this, so Let's get it unboxed and take a look Unbagged if you will White fender I think I see a sticker in there Nice Nice White, white front fender. Shroud plastics, black and white. And they give you all the screws to put it together. Two rear side covers. These are white. This is the factory color originally, but new stuff. And finally, New front number plate. I also have a new seat cover. I really wanted to go with the gray because, I mean, honestly, I love the way Yamaha did their color schemes on their YZs with the white and the gray and the black. It's beautiful, but I was unable to really find a nice gray seat. So I just went with a plain black seat and we're going to get rid of this green. But I didn't do it yet because I want to take a look at what the green looks like with the white plastics. It's probably going to look goofy. But I just want to see it before I go ahead and do the seat cover. The right rear plastic shroud shield deal comes with a heat shield, the rubber bumper, and the little washers, so pretty nice. I'm going to take out the metal spacers and the original fender is do not come with it. No, sir, I don't like it. No, sir, I don't like it.
just using a Harbor Freight Central Pneumatic Air Stapler. I think I paid like 16 bucks for this thing. And we're using the Arrow T50 Staples, quarter of an inch or six millimeter. Well, there she is. You guys tell me what you think. You like the black and the white? You prefer the green and the black? Or is there any other colors you like? Some people like the all black version. I think it looks beautiful. Also down in the comments, let me know what you think about the green spoke covers. I know a lot of people think that they're goofy, but I think they look pretty good. Or would black ones look better on this particular bike? Let me know. I'm curious to hear what you think about it. Well, thanks for watching. Hit that thumbs up. Hit that subscribe button if you haven't already. I would appreciate that. Hit that bell, let you know when my next video comes out. Appreciate you guys all watching. Now it's time to go hit the dunes.